die Herzogin von Sussex bei der Verleihung des Women of Vision Award am vergangenen Dienstag in New York. Nach der Wohltätigkeitsveranstaltung waren Meghan und Prinz Harry eigenen Angaben zufolge in eine gefährliche Verfolgungsjagd mit Paparazzi verwickelt, gemeinsam mit Megans Mutter. Um den Fotografen zu entkommen, nahmen das Trio und ein Bodyguard zeitweise ein Taxi. Für den Fahrer Sucharen Singh begannen damit aufregende Minuten. So I was going down 67th Street, East 67. I see a guy in a suit hail me, and he goes, "Listen, are you empty?" I go, "Yes." And he goes, "Are you looking for a fare?" And I was like, "Of course." And uh, he goes, "Pull over to the right." So I pull over to the right, and uh, a few minutes later, I see three people hop out of a black car right into uh, my cab, and it was Prince Harry and Meghan, and there was another woman with them as well. And then as we go drive straight, and as we're going straight. A uh, garbage truck was blocking us. He was picking up trash, and um, all of a sudden, paparazzi came out of nowhere and just started flashing, uh, taking pictures, and uh, you know, and they didn't stop until the security got out and said, "Move, move, move!" And then the garbage truck got out of the way, and the paparazzi were following the car. And Prince Harry and his wife and the other lady, they were nervous and they looked scared. Die Fahrt endete schließlich dort, wo sie begonnen hatte, nahe einer Polizeistation. The security guard told me, circle back. As we are circling back, uh, you see the paparazzi's car following my car. How did you feel about the situation? Uh, you know, my feelings were normal, but I'm sure their feelings were more intense because his, uh, uh, what his mom, uh, Princess Diana, died in a crash uh, running away from uh, uh, the paparazzi's. So I think uh, their emotions must have been higher. Harrys Mutter, Prinzessin Diana, war 1997 bei einem Autounfall in Paris ums Leben gekommen, nachdem sie von Paparazzi verfolgt worden war. Prinz Harry hat sich schon oft über das aggressive Vorgehen von Boulevardjournalisten gegenüber ihm und seiner Familie beklagt.